Yo, what's going on, 67 underscore? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1, and I am playing Bologna. It's try hard Thursday. I really don't want to use this skin. Uh, what is this skin? Oh, I don't really like this one. Oh, uh, well. I don't know. I got to see how it looks in game. Hold on. Yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Uh, Bologna's not like a cutesy warrior. She's like a, she's like a bathe in your blood type warrior, I feel like. And so putting putting Bologna in like a cutesy pink winged suit just seems like not the play to me. So maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. I, I definitely could be wrong, but like this this doesn't scream like badass blood warrior. Although I will admit I will admit that if you got killed by somebody wearing this it would feel a little bit worse i mean i'd imagine dying by itself feels pretty bad but dying while being humiliated would also feel bad i've never died before so i don't know but you know surely someone out there has we're just gonna get blue buff by the way because my abilities cost 60 mana each and I only have 325 mana. Um. Come on, man. Oh, he's doing red? It's so weird that he would do red. I mean, I guess it's not that weird. But I am going to try to do your blue. He's going to get the wave and then back and then be like full HP full mana probably I assume he knows he has time to back right he's not gonna just come over here and like be crazy about it nice he didn't back man he uh he's he was just wasting my time there by the way thank you for the sub DJ good morning AV skit uh he he can't die here because he knows i don't burst enough i mean now i do though he was not expecting the level five i'll tell you that much i will tell you that much he was very happy to be alive that i think he forgot that i could hit level five and just kill his ass <laughs> Three more autos. Um, holy guaca, shmoly oly boly. He's getting owned by these guys. What if I just like pow bam? Oh, not quite enough. Why are you not backing? My brother, you have a six HP. Leave immediately or face the consequence. Bro, he still hasn't left. He's crazy. Me, Amber, thank you so much for the prime. I didn't, uh, in case you're wondering, I didn't, like, send out a notification that I was live. Because I have to record Try Hard Thursday, and then I'll send out the notification that I was live, or that I'm live, because I want to play Senna's Hellblade 2. I don't know the name of the, the game. I just know that the first one was called Senna's Hellblade and it was an amazing game. Um, which by the way, YouTube, if you're watching this video right now, you can probably come over on, on over to Twitch and watch me play the game I'm talking about. Um, it's about this like lady Viking girl who has like psychosis, schizophrenia or some shit. And you're in her mind battling her demons and it's crazy, dude. That's a crazy, crazy game. I like it a lot. Can you stop running, though? Please? You and I can be besties if you don't run. Best friends. No. All right. All right. Fine, I guess. I'm going to just walk in here because I don't think it matters too much. Oh, God. There's an ult. Uh, I am going to ult the crap out of him if he walks over here. 
Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, I'm gonna die, 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 I'm dead, I'm gonna die. He's gonna come over here, he's gonna beat me up. Ah, Jesus. What's your build? Dominance? Yeah, he's definitely gonna kick my ass. Wait. You went to his blue? No, surely not. Surely this is... What? All right. All right, bad. I'll take it. What? I guess the next Smite 2 Alpha is next weekend. Ooh. That's pretty nice. Big Smite 2 fan. I, you know, honestly, Smite 2 is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Because I played it and it killed my enjoyment of Smite 1 a lot. Because I like Smite 2 so much. Okay, you are getting you are getting actually clobbered on. I thought I had my ult. This is unfortunate. I'm walking back in though. Slamming. Walking out. Then walking back in though. Ulting. Slamming. And the tower goes down. No, maybe the tower doesn't go down. Holy. I do 20 damage. This is so fuckled. Man. Let's just get out of here. The minions in there. Are you focused on the wave? I focused on the tower. Ow. You cannot fight me. You're a hunter and I am the anti-hunter. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that is that is extremely unlucky. What up, bacon? All right, let's get rock and then fight him if he shows up. And you've been horrific. You have no alt. I'm pretty sure it just means you die. All right, this is stupid though. I I quite literally cannot get this power. I'm just killing myself. I'm literally just gonna kill myself because like he's just gonna land on me and eat my ass now, and I have no mana. Ah, oh, jeepers! All right, all right, spam left me, spam left me. Do it. No, keep that same energy. Yeah, keep that same energy, buddy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Keep it. Go ahead. Where's all those laughing? Where's those laughing faces now? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Are you scared? You a little scared now? You a little scared? Yeah. That's what I figured. You're going to spam laugh me, but you ain't going to keep that energy when I come at you. That is, that is some high school bully shit. Yeah. Yeah, you thought. You thought, buddy. You thought, buddy. Alright, now he's going crit chance. Which is not bad. I think I could just go do um, Bull Demon, by the way, and there's like quite literally nothing you can do about it. I want to make sure I get red, though, so he can't. Um... Yeah, that's all right. 
I'll just go do Bull Demon. If he steals it with his ult, fair play. But my goal here is to uh, keep it in this the back pit as possible. Equinox and my three will keep me alive, full, full health. Um, and then basically just like annoy the piss out of him. I'll get it low and then I'll fight him and then I'll like switch him up. You know what I mean? Oh, you're ulting now. Or oh, you're sprinting away. That's fine too. That is fine too. There's a sprint. Bring this back here more. Yep. Yep. You still want to fight this? Let's get his ult. All right. Now he has no way to run away. So next time I hit my three, he dies. Or next time I hit my one, he dies. There we go. Very easy way to get rid of uh, a little nuisance on my bull demon. Um, I'm pretty sure I can just simply W key him. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't given up, if I'm like completely honest. Alright, now you dash away. And now I fight you anyways. Hello, Feeny. Um, my next item, probably just going to get Oboe so I can hit the Titan and him at the same time. Oh. He hasn't gotten your chest, man. You didn't even get your treasure chest. The best thing on the map you're neglecting? How dare you? Actually, how dare you? Tim the bully. I'm not the one who laughed. I'm not the one who brought the energy, okay? I'm the one keeping it. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. You know what I mean? That's what he's done here today. Um... Let's grab... I'm just going to go Mystical and Thorns. So, like, the whole goal is walk into Titan. I mean, I could go Fire Blink, too. That would work also, but... Literally, walk into Titan and just slap the shit out of that thing. I'm coming for your titan. There's nothing you can do. You might as well sit in your base and chew on some food. You can't stop me killing this. You are gonna lose. All right. Well. Pow, pow, pow. 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 Horrific. Pow, pow, pow. Yep, well, he lost. 510 damage from Oboe. GG. I'll see you guys in game two. Easy game one. Welcome back to game number two. I'm playing a little bit of Sukuyomi, and they're playing Bacchus. So, that's unfortunate for him. Angry Bunny 74466. Isn't this guy like a like a GM player? I, or did did he used to be? I know his name. He's either really low MMR or really high MMR. There's no one between. I, I know his name for some reason. Um, I I hope it's high MMR. My money's on the Bacchus. I'm a thousand dollar bet. If I lose, I'll give I'll give Chat two hundred subs. 
If I win, you give chat 200 subs deal. He's 1600. Um, let's go. Let's go. Let's go beads. He's going to try to stop my two with his burp and I'm not going to let him. No, thank you, buddy. All right, I'm basically out of mana if I press my three. Sure, sure, sure. I'm down. Let's get out of mana. All right, Angry Bunny 74466. Are you ready for this? Because I am. I was born ready. I got 11 years of practice under the belt. Wow, I actually clear so slow. <laughs> I think he cleared just as fast as I did, and that's a that's a toxic trait I have. Alright. Now it's time to fight, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. I, I do believe your cooldowns are 13 seconds long, though, so don't you just die here because you belly flopped me. Oh. That's so unfortunate that I have beads because I, I, I predicted this exact predicament. This exact predicament. Now I slowly clear these out. This, this is taking a minute. Not using my abilities is taking a minute. Nope. No burp for you, buster. Um, will this kill him? Oh, it will. Nice. Nice. I didn't think it would. All right, so I got Soul Eater on the rise. 1,700 gold in pocket. Uh, I could back and start stacking. stack a lacking But this guy's surrendering in five minutes. Like, he's he's definitely not... He's definitely not playing this game out. Yep, yep. That, that's the alt of, of someone who's already quit mentally. That's the alt of somebody who's like, I will never get a kill opportunity anyways. Might as well alt, you know? He's sad about that. Wait, I want red. Uh, okay, never mind. Let's go get Soul Eater. You know, I could be a complete douche nozzle. And I could go, um... I could go Pestilence here. And he just loses. He, he, like, he literally just gets owned if I go Pestilence here because he has his Bancrofts, his healing, and his kit. And he's never going to kill me anyways. I don't want to be that guy, but I definitely could. Oh, you're dead, by the way. Um, I think I'm still kind of a douche because I went Blackthorn instead of Soul Eater. But, I don't know, man. Let's try our Thursday. Let's try our Thursday. I'm winning. If this game doesn't end at five minutes, I've done wrong. Um, okay, well, you just jumped over the wall. Why am I so slow? Why do you feel so fast? What is going on here? What trickery is happening? That's not the play. Jumping on me is not the play. I think you die here, actually. Oh, horrific. All right, hold on. Maybe he jumps on me. Jump on me. Look, oh, look I'm so, I'm so breathable and fragile. There we go. I'm not going to put me in my two, by the way. Big kill. 
Oh, you know what, dude? Fuck it. I'm being that guy. I'm being that guy. I'm Blackthorn Pestilence. Good luck. You'll never kill me. I win. Nice try. Better luck next game, buddy. It doesn't matter what items you build now because you will literally never kill me. I could sit under your tower for nine tower shots and still win the fight. Hello. Uh, yeah, I missed. Uh, I think I'm going to just take this. Are you cool with that? Yeah. Cool with that? I did 100 damage. Oh, let's go get red. What's my next item here? Low key, just kind of thinking serrated. He has Aegis, so I can't alt him because I'll just I'll alt under Phoenix and just get owned. What I can do is go do Bolt Demon though. It is probably worth it for me to get this because it's gonna do or it's gonna help me do damage to Bolt Demon. Okay. I think his ult literally did 200 damage. Okay. okay. I took... I took more damage from minions and phoenix than I did from him. In fact, I took more damage from just minions than I did from him. I feel bad, man. But I told you this is this is what has to happen. We got the wave. Oh, we backed. Um, serrated is twenty six, right? Twenty five. Even better. Even better. So you know what I could do now is I could go Hydras and I could just poly auto the tower. When you say poly, it's a Hydras auto. I get Hydras auto the tower. Um, because if you do, if you don't know, ever since Tsukiyomi even came out, like it's been it's been a thing since his his history, is uh you can auto from you can auto the objective from outside of range. So I can literally sit here like this and just like slowly take it. I need some cooldown though for it. I mean, if I ult him, he's just going to age us. Oop. Oop. Yeah, you can you can tell from just that slight interaction how impossible it is for him to kill me. How much damage he took just trying to hurt me. This will take a minute. I'm going to go get Hydras. You know what? I'm going to get Hydras and a 500 pot. And a red buff. Better not be going for that red buff, Buster. All right. 
There we go. There we go. Just get him out of my hair for a little. Now, with the 500 pot and red buff, I've essentially doubled my damage. And then with Hydras also. Or like tier 2 Hydras. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. Oh, there we go. Those are some... Buddy. Buddy. How much damage he takes, though? My goodness. All right, now they take one step forward and die. Oh, you didn't die. All right, I think you're dead, though. All right. The Feeny is down. At this point, I almost feel like I could sit in my base and I'd win. Because I I don't see a conceivable way that Bacchus deals with fire minions. Just, just ever. I really don't think he ever deals with them. I mean... I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. But it's going to be a painful process for him. For sure. Uh, let's go. I guess we'll just go Heartseeker now. Because we'll have, we'll have 40% pen. We'll have 40% pen because we'll have Serrated, Hydras, and Heartseeker. We'll have defense because of Pestilence. Basically double defense because of Blackthorn because 350 health is super defensive. Um... And then I think I'm just going to do the same shit I was doing to his Phoenix, but now to his Titan. Actually, I think I could just walk into his Titan room. Like, nope. Not hit me with that. Don't know who you think you are, but not hit me. There's the Aegis. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Wow. All right. Yeah, this this game is just not fair like it's it is simply not fair he doesn't get to have any fun well gg i'll see you guys in game number three i guess what's up gamers welcome back to game number three i'm playing a little bit of uleron because uh he's busted as hell right now if you don't know i did make a video about him um but i believe the video i believe the video was Actually, maybe I didn't make a video about it. I'm I'm trying to remember, like, did I did I actually, or am I trolling myself? Because I thought for sure that I did, but maybe I didn't. Either way, um, he now, instead of his maximum crit chance being 70%, it is now 100%. And instead of um, his maximum crit damage being 115%, it's 125%. And he does 20% more damage on his one the longer you charge it. Um, so that's that's a thing. All those things are things that happen. Um, I want the blue buff. I actually kind of want red buff because my, my mana consumption doesn't seem that bad, to be honest with you. I think you underestimate how much damage I deal. Oh, close. All right, so what I'm going to do here... I'm going to get the red buff, and then I'll back. And I'm going to get Chalice of Healing. 
And then I'll go to my blue buff now. Get red buff back, blue buff. He's getting blue buff and then he's going to clear the wave. So he's going to be a little bit ahead of me for a second. But that's okay. He just hit four. I will hit five on this wave. I mean, if I timed everything right, I'll hit five. If I didn't, then... Oh, well. Nice. A lot of people super underestimate Oleron's early game damage. Like his level three fight. It's actually very, very good. He's just going to run. I can't kill him here. I can't kill him here. That's all right. One more wave and then I get my my uh, Bancrofts. He's obviously going Griffin Wing. Because why wouldn't you on a Hunter? Let's clear the wave. Go back. Get Bancrofts. And then, honestly, I feel kind of invincible. I find it's going to be very hard for him to fight me. We're pretty much even. I mean, he's going to get the rock, unfortunately. I kind of messed up the rock timing. I forgot it spawns at two minutes. So that kind of stinks, but it's okay. All right. No, if I hit those things, imagine how good at this game I'd be. Alright, nice. Nice try. Not today, though. Oh, 270 on that. That's not bad. Hmm. All right. All right. I thought that my life steal would be a bit better there, but it wasn't. That's my bad. That is my bad. I guess, you know, he's not going defense second item either actually is he getting red he is getting red that stinks for me all right well i get rock and i get his blue buff maybe Nice. Nice. His alt and his blue buff. Very, very good. Um. Hmm. Now, obviously, you can, you can tell I'm going berserkers. I don't know if I want to go berserkers. Is the thing. I kind of just want to go. Typhons, but I, I know he's going to get the anti helixy obviously. Which makes me not want to get more lifesteal. Oh, he went Aussie instead. Surely that's not the right move. Oh, did I get none of those? That's... That's criminal. It's criminal that I got none of those. Yeah, with red buff and Aussie, he wins the fight. So I just gotta, I just gotta chill out and wait. That's fine. He more than likely is gonna go bull demon here. Oh, he's just getting rock. All right, fine by me. Fine by me. 
Griffin went good on Oleron. Yeah, it's not it's not terrible. I think he just backed. Berserkers is going to help a lot. Seventy-two damage. Uh, oh nice. He's going. He's going pestilence here. I just want to life steal a little bit. Alright. That is really good for me because not only did I just obviously win that fight, but I also... I should be able to kill him here. Yeah. Nice. I knew like with how much he's he's been caring about red buff and rock this game um I knew he was he was gonna stay for it whether he died for the fight or not he was gonna stay for it just by reading his body language so like you you can tell he does not want to give that shit up Yes, Oleron's alt or Oleron's one now does twenty percent more damage while charging, like from zero percent to twenty percent increased damage. I don't know what I want second relic yet. He went talisman instead of pestilence. He's doing every single option in the fucking book other than actually getting anti heal. That cannot be good. Damn. I think I might just do Bull Demon. What does my body language tell me? It tells me you want me. Or I might just alt this tower. Yeah, I do way more damage than you, bro. Ouch. I do kind of want a um, a toxic blade here. I don't care about any little damage he does to me, to be honest with you. Okay, that was that was fucking clinical. That was actually clinical. Um I cannot get the Phoenix here, but I can do some good damage to it. There's a phoenix. There is a phoenix and also probably a red buff again. Okay, he's not going to let me back here, so I'm just going to run back.
Oh, he's doing my blue. I really figured he'd try to like push tower a, a bit more. Um, I think what I'm going to do though, is I'm going to get mid guardian and I'm going to get, uh, probably just a horrific, a 500 pot. And then, I mean, not really anything else I can do there. That's fine. Horrific mid guardian and a 500 pot. Because my damage is more than enough. Yeah, I want the attack. I wanted the attack speed Bancroft's upgrade, but I didn't get it in time. Because I'm a bozo. I didn't have the gold for it in time. Oh, he got anti-heal finally. No, oh, he got a 500 pot too. Interesting. Um... Ow. And I stink. Just gonna go do blue. Oh, I can't. Well, then I'll go do this. Um, I'm thinking I want. Uh, Staff of Mirrodin, actually. Does, does my ult... Well, actually, I the question is, does my ult go on cooldown instantly or not? Because if not, then I don't want Staff of Mirrodin. If it does, then I do. This positioning I have. All right, never mind. Never mind. I like it. All right. I, I think I do enough damage to end here, right? I do not. That's okay. That's okay. Here we got the Phoenix. I'm just going to walk away. Um... He's not chasing me, right? He's just going to do red. I'd imagine. Let's just go rod and then upgrade this. Because that's going to give me 12 stacks, which is 24% attack speed and 24 basic attack power, which is actually a lot of damage. And then because I just re-got the Phoenix, I'm pretty sure my ult comes up before the Phoenix does. And then I just walk in and I ult the Titan. I think. He's going Kins, by the way. I don't like the Kins play. All right, GG, there we go. The win, baby. And um, that is kind of all the time we have, but maybe I'll do one more game.
just for fun. So I'll see you guys in one more game. What's up, boys? Last game of the video. Unless I lose, in which case I'll cut this out and play another one. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I, I, I never cut out losses on Tryhard Thursday. If I get owned while tryharding, then I deserve to be owned. Um, But I'm playing Fenrir. I haven't played Fenrir in a long time. Um, let's go Jotuns. To do what's necessary. Let's go Jotuns. Horrific. Actually, I kind of want to go Wing Shard. I never go Wing Shard anymore, but that item is OP. Do I go Med? Because he's going to be healing, and if I also heal, then maybe we heal together, and then I beat him. Because it's an even playing field. If I don't go Med, let's say I go Horrific, right? And he goes, he goes something. I lower his healing, but then he gets a shield. So I'm a, I'm slightly lower. You see what I'm saying? You see where I am? See where I'm at? See where my brain's at? I'm going horrific. Get Sunder so you can alt cancel Sunder. So I can alt and then cancel my alt and then Sunder? <laughs> what the fuck are you on about, man? That's not how this works. <laughs> Yo, YouTube, Sam asked me to smell my... Sam asked to smell my armpit weird. Stuff, man. I mean, don't kink shame me, bro. If I'm, in, if I'm into smelly armpits, that's what I'm into. Don't come at me like that. Did he go blue? He did. I've been owned. Wait. No. Wow, that stun was long. Holy. Can I just do red? Like, will you allow me? It doesn't really seem like he wants to allow me to, but... No, actually, he would. He would have. Why does he do... I, I feel dead. I feel like I'm dead right now. He's gonna stun me. Uh, yeah! Oh, I tried to ult, but I don't have the mana for it. <laughs> Shit, man! Why do I use more mana than he does? He's a mage. Um... Holy. Holy, the insta alt. Good golly, Miss Molly. He did that really quick. Well, let's just go Yodens. Like I'm never gonna I'm never gonna do well early game against Zonkwe. One, because it's fucking Zonkwe. He's got infinite clear and infinite sustain because of the clear. Two, I started Yotens, which is a good start, but it doesn't leave you with a lot of potions, which means you don't get a lot of actually longevity in the lane, meaning you never get the first red buff. So with both of those things combined, I just get owned early game. I'm I'm a late game player. I'm playing for the late. If I can stay even on levels until I get third item, I think we're chilling. If I can just stay even, then I think we're chilling. I need to get his alt. Or I, I need to get his beads. Find my me. Your middle tower is under attack. Okay. Holy. Holy shit, this guy's aggressive, dude. He just ran through tower and insta ulted. I mean, he, he knows I can't fight him, but still, holy fuck. I'm assuming you did my blue. You did. 
Okay, I'm very far behind in levels now. I'm like a full level behind, which is not good. But I mean, him him being Bancroft Zonkwe, I just can't. I just can't compete with him right now. There will be a turning point, hopefully. But this, the turning point is not now. That's for sure. I just let my scepter stop his back, by the way. Um, I do have my, my alt up. God damn, you are tanky, dude. Holy. Holy, you are tanky. I kind of feel like I should have gone, um, I should have gone breastplate instead, or not breastplate, that, that would be fucking tragic. Um, I should have gone pestilence instead. Wait, he just hit level 10 and I'm still level 9. Oh god. Get the full breastplate online. Um. Yeah, this is going to be basically a try to stem the bleeding situation for the first 20 minutes. Why are you there? Why not just push the wave? I didn't get any of them, did I? Stinks. This matchup fucking stinks. I'm getting owned. I can't ever fight him. I just do no damage, man. I do no damage and I can't compete. Um, I have to go beat stick next item. I don't really have an option for an item. It just has to be beat stick. Um, okay, I guess. I could, I mean, it could be Xe or Toxoplate or something, but actually, yes. I think I will go Xe. I think I'm going to transition to auto attack based. What if like Xe anti heal Xe plus a uh, plus Aussie maybe? Is he doing bull demon? He might be. Yeah, he did. I mean, that's good. That is really good. I 
I need to clear this wave before I back. Alright, that gives me Xe, which means I do some sort of damage. I'm also going to go Thorns because Thorns does magical damage and he's not going to have magical defense. And with Pen and Thorns, maybe I can win this fight and keep my tower alive. The only reason I'm going Thorns is for this one singular fight to keep my tower. Perfect. Perfect. Let's go, dude. The one reason I went thorns. I mean, it didn't do that much, but it helped a little bit. We need to get this tower down. And then get one of the blue buffs. I'm glad I decided to turn my brain on for this game because you're just gonna stun. Guess what, buddy? I do not care. Thank you. Thank you, baby. Because if I didn't turn my brain on, I, if I kept playing the same way, like ability based, I would have lost. 100%. I have to out auto attack him. So we're going to do this. And then he's got no anti heal. So we're going to go Aussie. And I think we're actually going to go Aussie into Serrated. Your middle tower is under attack. He's out red. I don't know if I can fight a red buff guy, but. Perfect. Perfect. I didn't know if I could fight him or not, but I figured I could. So I just went for it. Um... I should be able to get this. I got minions here. I want him to stun me. And then I, I can thorns in three. Nice. Very nice, dude. Yo, that XE just started slapping, man. It's a really good thing I turned my brain on. I don't know if I can end here, though. I'm not doing that much damage right now. I don't, I don't want to die or anything. No ending here. He keeps buying proximity wards, which is a complete and total waste until um until you're like ready for the fight yeah he's just gonna surrender he can't do anything he can't do anything i'm gonna finish aussie get tier two serrated and a red pot like a 500 pot and then he just dies like he knew it he had so what he had to do what he had to do in order to win that game or keep up that kind of like pace that he that he was keeping was not go defense, which sounds counterintuitive because the whole reason I couldn't kill him was because he was so tanky. But his passive gives him 40 physical protection, which is basically as much as Breastplate of Valor. You can't really see it. It's it's 50. Breastplate is 50. But if you go Bancrofts into Typhons, and I have to go defense second, meaning my, my anti-heal is third item, where you're getting double life steal plus pen on second item, 
Um, you're snowballing that early lead that you that you created for yourself by picking Zongkui with Bancrofts. I'm not gonna be able to fight you uh until my third item is finished. And then once my third item is finished, then you get the breastplate, right? So like we'll both be three items because you'll still be ahead of me. So you'll have double lifesteal, I'll have anti-heal, but you'll have breastplate. So it's gonna be the same build, except instead of demonic, you have typhons, and you're gonna be doing way more damage. And the fights are going to be even. So I think that's what he could have done. He maybe even could have bought a red pot for that for that fight. The the tower defense fight that really like switched the the entire video game. Because I was losing. And I had to go. I had to go XE. Honestly, he could have even just not gone breastplate and gone mid guardian. And I would have I would have lost, I think. Yeah, actually, if he goes no D, if he goes no cooldown, he just goes mid guardian because I'm forced into XC because I can't I can't be ability based against Zong Kuei because he's just gonna out trade me, and I can't be auto attack against a mid guardian early game because I just lose. So that's what he should have done. Bancroft's Typhons mid guardian because I have to go Jotun's Genji's uh, XC. I mean, I, this could have been a pestilence to be fair. But I wanted the cooldown. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.